What's up everybody, it's Ultimate Out Products here. And today I'm going to review Slanter Clock by Cloudy Cloudy 626. And it's a clock that's like when you, the lock screen clock, that whenever you turn it on, it will be slanted like that. <coughs> so I've seen this video this morning by iCryptic, and if you don't know who he is, I'll have a link to his YouTube channel underneath. He's a pretty good guy. He reviews a lot, a lots of themes and tweaks and stuff like me. Okay. So anyhow, so this is what Slanty Clock is. Okay, it shows you the weather and the time and what day it is. Okay. So once you download it, you're gonna see that it says you need to download files. Those two little period, uh, no dots slash slash from city. So you just wanna go to search. And then search file. Okay. Okay, so file, and it should be the first thing that pops up. It should say file the two low dots slash slash for mobile Safari. Download that, and it should respring your i device. And once it respring,s you're gonna go into city uh into mobile Safari, and you're just gonna put in. Hold on. Wait. Okay, so so you're gonna put in file the two low dot slash 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 library slash theme slash slanted slanted clock with a capital uh capital S and a capital L for clock clock I mean C Sla I mean capital S L A N T E D L capital L O C T Okay, you're just gonna put in that slash slash config dot H T M L okay and it should bring you to this, okay? So once you go to this, you'll see that. Hold on. Okay, so once you go to Slanted Clock Configuration, you're going to press. It's going to show up as none. You're going to just press Accurate Weather for Accurate Weather or Yahoo Weather. So I'm just going to click with Yahoo Weather. Put in your. Uh, this is this is already going to be there, and you just put in your like a zip code, okay? So if you want Accurate or Weather for a real f uh, feel. You press yes or no, and if you want the uh, Fahrenheit or like this one here, I don't can't remember what it's called right now. Or do you want that 12 hour, 24 hour like display? So I'm just gonna press 12 hours, and you can just pick which icon set you want. You want it to be HCC or tick or clear. I'm just gonna pick click, and then let me tick, and then update interval uh, interval, and you're just gonna press either 30, 20, or 15. I put it on 30 so it can waste less, it doesn't waste as much battery, okay? Or you can put it as other as any, like whatever you want. So you can put wallpaper set, you can pick like default, which one you want, or you can just browse, browse through the ones. And if you want the style sheet, it should say slanted, slanted clock like that. And just press set configurations, and then settings saved, okay? And then you might want to just bookmark this just so that way if you ever want to edit it or nothing, you can edit it like that, okay? So, that's pretty cool. And once you, like, do that, you should turn it off or spring it first if you want to. And it should look like this, but it should still have the clock right here. Or, like, whatever right here. And if you want the, like, the slider to be gone and the clock to be gone, all you gotta do is just go to Cydia, download, uh, no lock screen clock. And that should take off, and then like you go into settings, you go into settings, hold on, sorry for it, to, it takes a while for my settings to load up, please. okay, so you just go to settings, and then clock out, okay, and then you can just enable it, and it wouldn't, it doesn't respring or nothing, and then you go into winterboard, and then you download no slider from studio also. And then once you go to uh, you go to winterboard and then enter that you can press no slide or nothing, okay? So it will have no slider or nothing. So instead of it having a slider, it'll look like that, okay? So thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.